This is a TM1602 modem, and in this video, I'm going to show you how we uh, connect the eMMC to the Ulink NT. And uh, the key to the three signaling is one is command, which is on this side, the other one is clock and data. Clock is here, data is here. These two wires are a little bit difficult and the rest will be the power, which is in here. So the first thing we need to do is to scrape off the paint here. So use the, the knife and carefully scrape off the, the pad here. I have carefully scraped off the paint here and here. Don't make sure there is no cut here. So as long as expose the copper, uh, this will be good. So now I'm going to put some flux and solder uh, to the pads first. First, put some flux. Then use the solder iron, put some solder on it. I'm going to use this six uh, pins here, and it will be power, 3.3 uh, volt, ground, and TD, uh, S -D -I -D -O, and then the clock and the command. So I will put, put it in, in here. First, I need to solder wires to this pin head here. Okay, I have soldered the six pins here and with the two wires here shorted. So I'm going to use this side as power. This side will data zero and one will be clock and one will be uh, command. We can glue the pin head here and here I'm using hot glue to apply some hot glue here and then press down so now i'm going to solder some wires on it here it's ground is soldered let's solder the 3.3 .3 volt This is a DAT0. This 
to the clock. The last one is a command. So you need to check if there's a shortage and also make sure the ground and the power are connected properly. This is how the Unink NT and the target are connected. And then we can use the uh, Unink NT software to read and write the NAND flash.